Hey guys, welcome back to another Call of Duty Mobile video. We have the first teaser of Season 7 from the Chinese version. What we have is a map and it does look like it has some cyberpunk vibes. So it is going to be something related to dystopian futuristic setting. This theme is somewhat similar to the Season 1 New Order where we got a brand new Season 1 for the first time after 13 seasons in Phase 1. Please note that they have not released any official statements regarding this map and it is related to the theme of the season. But surely they will not release a map that is exclusive to call of duty mobile without a reason without a change to the theme because previously when we get a new map they are all maps from other call of duty games but this time it is different this is the image teaser that we have and on left top we have atlas corporation will build a better future sure atlas corporation is in call of duty advanced warfare but we haven't seen this map in it in the first image we can see a mega city just like the city in cyberpunk combined with low life and high technology in the second image we can see it says welcome to new vision city and the translation says it is a transportation hub so by the looks of it it does not look like it is going to be a chinese exclusive so this will come to the global version as well the third image is a little bit confusing one the place is surrounded by some kind of a smoke or a fog but the image translation says it is about some kind of a museum and the final image shows some kind kind of a power source or a data storage in future according to the translation it says secret core technology center so what do you guys think about this map i know we can't say much about the map without seeing a cinematic but then again with this theme and what i have seen so far i think it will be good and many people are confused whether we are going to get two brand new mythics next season this is because according to the files in the test server both switchblade and creek 6 are mythics we can be sure of one thing is that switchblade is the next mythic because it is the only blueprint that we can use in the test server so there's no way creek 6 is coming in season 7 if we assume that we don't get two mythics in season 7 which is anyway outrageous creek 6 will be pushed to season 8 strangely i don't think we will see a legendary butterfly knife instead we are going to get a legendary katana with the legendary operator in season 8 right now we can't be sure of the other weapon that will come in season 7 i personally believe it should be the butterfly knife because since we are not going to get a legendary variant for the butterfly knife and it does not make any sense to be released in a season where we are going to get a legendary operator i think we will see butterfly knife in season 7 another question is that are we going to get the mythic as well in season 7 in season 7 we will not see a mythic redux because according to the order we should be getting a legendary operator redux in season 7 so the next legendary operator draw that we are going to get in season 7 should be a legendary ashra redux if you want to know more about these all legendary operators i have already made a video you can check it out i have seen many people praise legendary ashra after seeing all 10 legendary operators because it is one of a kind in addition, we will be able to equip completion camos such as Ether Crystal and exclusive seasonal tournament camos like Red Sprite and Glacier Ripple on blueprints. What I made by blueprints is not just legendaries and mythics. You can literally equip these camos with any blueprint. Currently, it is unknown whether we will see it next season, but since test server already has this feature, definitely we will see it soon. Here are some of the popular legendaries and mythics with different camos. I'm just showing them to show you the amount of possibilities we have. Think of the skin customization. Think of the amount of skins you can make by yourself after grinding these camos. It is just mind blowing. This is clearly one of the best things they will ever do in future. I'm just curious how many seasonal camos you already have unlocked. I mean red sprite and glacial ripple camos. Leave a comment in the comment section. I hope I cleared some of your doubts that you have about season 7. If you find this video helpful please leave a like like. make sure you subscribe and click the bell icon watch my other videos and i will see you guys in the next one